Hello, welcome to Easy Ayurveda videos. I am Dr. Raghuram. In this video, I will speak about the use of Panchakola Churna in treating Amavata. The condition Amavata is compared to the modern day disease Rheumatoid Arthritis. In the earlier stages of manifestation, Amavata will present with gut related symptoms associated with pain and swelling in the body parts which may not be well marked. These symptoms also appear like they are the premonitory symptoms of Amavata though they have been mentioned as general symptoms of Amavata. If the earlier stage is not treated promptly, the disease manifests as a systemic disease with severe pain in almost all the joints of the body. Other systemic symptoms will also be present depending on the tissues and organs involved. Angamardha, Aruchihi, Trishna, Alasyam, Gauravam, Jwaraha, Apakata, Shunata, Anganam, Amavatasya, Lakshanam. Vague body pains as if beaten by someone, tastelessness, thirst, lethargy, heaviness of the body, fever, indigestion and swelling in the body parts are the symptoms of early manifestation or gut level manifestation of Amavata or rheumatoid arthritis. If this condition is taken care of, the disease will not progress to successive complicated stages. In my clinical experience, I have seen that Panchakola Churna works magically in the gut level manifestation of Amavata. Panchakola Churna is a combination of powders of 5 herbs taken in equal proportions. They are Pippali that is long pepper, Pippali Moola that is roots of long pepper, Chavya that is Piper Retrofractum, Chitraka that is Plumbago Xylanica and Nagara or Shunti that is the ginger. This powder is generally used in correction of metabolic errors as an appetizer, carminative, digestant and remedy for many gastrointestinal and digestive disorders. It is one of the praised medicines in Amavata or Rheumatoid Arthritis. Panchakola is used in many forms to treat Amavata. The first one is Panchakola Churna or powder form of Panchakola. Panchakola ka churnam tu pibet ushnena varina mandagni shula gulma ama kapha arochaka nashanam. Panchakola Churna should be taken with hot water. When taken, it cures weak digestion, colic, abdominal tumors, kapha imbalance and indigestion. This is also a good remedy in the earlier gut level manifestation of rheumatoid arthritis. It is readily available with many Ayurveda pharmacies. The second form is decoction form of Panchakola that is Panchakola Kvata or Panchakola Kashayam. It is also called as Pippalyadi Kvatham. Pippali, Pippali Moola, Chavya Chitraka Nagaraihi, Kvatitam, Vari, Tatpeyam, Amavata Vinashanam. 10 grams of the coarse powder of Panchakola is boiled with 160 ml of water until one fourth of it remains. The contents are filtered. The resultant liquid which remains is the decoction. It should be served fresh. Panchakola is very strong medicine and many people might not tolerate its pungent and hot nature. In mild to moderate form of Amavata and also in cases of intolerance, less quantity of Panchakola Churna may be taken to prepare the decoction. The decoction is taken once or twice in a day, generally before food or as recommended by your physician. The third form is Panchakola Paniya Jala that is water boiled with medicine. Amavata Abhibhutaya Piditaya Pipasaya Panchakolena Samsiddham Paniyam Hitamuchate. Drinking the water boiled with Panchakola powder whenever the patient feels thirsty will not only relieve thirst but also relieves the symptoms of Amavata. Regular water shall not be used until the symptoms subside. 
the fourth and the most praised preparation is the panchakola fanta that is hot infusion of panchakola in this 2 to 5 grams of the medicine is put in a glass or vessel 150 to 200 ml of boiling water is poured over the powder the vessel is kept closed for a few minutes later the water should be taken for drinking it should be sipped at regular intervals it should be used in place of regular water it can either be taken before or after food or as and when required until the symptoms reduce finally Master Chakradatta tells Amavate Panchakola Siddham Panam Annam Ishyate A person suffering from Amavata that is rheumatoid arthritis especially at the gut level should always take food water and drinks processed with Panchakola this is said to be wholesome in Amavata if one of these forms of Panchakola is used in Amavata that is at the gut level manifestation of amavata it will definitely relieve the symptoms the effect of medication can be enhanced by combining it with external treatments mainly dhanyamla dhara in which fermented medicinal liquids are poured on the body in streams and shar valuka sveda that is hot sand sudation or sand bed sudation to forms a useful combo with panchakola medications thanks for watching the video to learn ayurveda in an easier way keep watching easy ayurveda videos